6v6 maps, I should say, and then, oh, killed like half the team. Everyone just wanted to line up in front of me. It's time for me to go off and end this on a good note because so far, gameplay's been tough. I don't know what to tell you. It's fine. All good. I'm going to calm down. I'm Bro, you can't make this up. <laughs> this is not scripted. I kid you not. This is not scripted. Like, what's going on, bro? I'm very close to getting my war machine. As soon as I get it, I'm going to go crazy. Yeah, I'm done, man. I'm done. Doing something. Behind me. Teammate, thank you for that advanced. I love you so much for it. Alright, spawn trap. Spawn trap. I want to play a little bit more passive. I know they're to my right. There's one guy. Okay. After a rough start to the game, boys. We're slowly streaking up. And spawns flipped. What's up, Black Phillip? How you doing, boy? I see you proning. Strategic, if you ask. Me. Watch out! Watch out, Philip! Uh, I need to watch out too. Alright, so we're doing this a couple days after BO6's reveal event. I did make a video on my thoughts on the game and my reaction to the live event. If you guys didn't watch it, it's live on my channel. It's something I've never done before, if I'm being honest with you. It was my first reaction video and I really enjoyed it. And I'll be making more reaction videos to Call of Duty, uh, pretty much events, Call of Duty videos, whatever the case is. So hopefully you guys are ready for that. But for today, I decided to hop on and play Black Ops Cold War again, because honestly, I haven't played this game since my last Black Ops Cold War video, which was posted, I believe, eight days ago. And the Black Ops 6 trailer just made me want to play this game again. I'm pretty sure you guys watched the trailer and uh, the event, and you can pretty much agree with me that BO6 looks similar to Black Ops Cold War, but obviously I'm more updated version of it, which is what I mentioned in my previous Black Ops Cold War video. I wanted BO6 to have that Black Ops Cold War feel. And we're getting a lot of new things. We're getting three lane maps. We're getting the classic prestige system, which is very exciting. And I'm not focused at all. And that's very disappointing if you ask. But yeah, I'm going to make a separate video with some gameplay in the background. And I'm going to answer some questions that you guys might have. If you guys have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comments down below. And I'm also going to talk about my thoughts on the game in detail because obviously the reaction video was more of a reaction per se. I couldn't talk much because there was a lot going on and this guy's hiding in the corner. But yeah, I'm going to make a separate video. So again, if you guys have any questions or if you want me to talk about specific things, I'm going to talk about the classic prestige system, about the things that I like, the things that I'm looking forward to. And I finally got a kill. But yeah, I'm going to talk about everything that I noticed in the reveal trailer. I'm going to talk about the things that I'm excited for, like the classic prestige system, the three lane maps. Be on the lookout for that video. I'm going to drop it very soon. And in the meantime, just make sure you leave some questions in the comments down below if you guys have any. And I need to focus. That's one. There's one more guy. Oh, there's a lot of them. Yeah, this game's pretty much over. As you guys can tell, I'm not the best when it comes to commentating and playing this game, especially when I have a lot of points to talk about. But again, we'll save that for a separate video. Just let me know what kind of topics you want me to go into and let me know what kind of questions you might have. Drop in the comments down below and I'll add it to the video. Yeah, let me know on a scale of 1 to 10, how excited are you for Black Ops 6? I'm very, very excited. I would say maybe a 9 out of 10 simply because we've seen a few things and the things we saw were really good. But at the same time, I feel like we need to see more before we're fully, fully excited. And I feel like a lot of things might go wrong with the game. For example, skill-based matchmaking might be a problem. There's a lot of issues that the game might have. And again, based on what we saw, I feel like it's it's very normal for us to be excited. But at the same time, I'm still being a little bit cautious. Hopefully with Call of Duty next coming up in about 
two months, two and a half months, we'll be able to see more of the game. Based on that, I'm going to revisit my rating and I'll tell you honestly how excited I am. But for the time being, if I'm being fully honest, I would say maybe an eight and a half, nine out of ten, which is pretty good. Let me guess. Another late join. Yep. I knew it. I knew it. At least it's hijacked. You can never say no to hijacked. Which brings me to my next point about BO6. They said they're going to bring out, what, 12, 12 new maps? Yep. Sniped in the back. But yeah, we're going to have 12 new maps, uh, 6v6 maps, I should say. And then, oh. The title for today's video is going to be, why can we not talk about BO6 without dying? That's going to be the title of the video. But yeah, they said they're going to bring out 12 new 6v6 maps. So again, they're not going to be remastered maps or maps we've seen in previous Call of Duties. But I have a feeling they're going to add in maybe a couple maps as a surprise or maybe when seasons come out each season, they might add some remastered map. That's what I'm hoping for. And my teammate is clueless and he doesn't know what a mini map is. But yeah, that's what I'm hoping for. Honestly, like I wouldn't mind some remastered maps like Nuketown, Firing Rain, Hijack, some maybe BO3 maps, maybe not some BO4 maps because I'm not a fan of those maps. But yeah, I would want to see like Summit from BO1, Firing Rain, some BO2 maps. Obviously, Nuketown's in the game because we did see a leak. I'm not sure if I have the image. I'll try to put it on the screen. That leads me to believe that the game is going to have some brand new maps or a lot of new maps, but we're going to have some remastered maps too. Why do I keep dying from behind? Okay, let's quickly make it to their spawn and hopefully spawn trap them. He's gone. So They're already on B. Two of them. All this. Oh, you sneaky little boy. I see you. See, I keep forgetting to stim. I feel like stimming is more important than reloading. Like, you need to stim before you reload. Because, again, stimming is going to help you win a lot of gunfights. You can re-challenge. And you can just play a little bit more aggressive. Anyone here? No. I mean, they're still spawning back there. They're just hey, up. Hey! Need to capture B boys. Someone push B. I got this. I'm pushing them away from it. Yeah, my teammates don't want to play objective. I know I'm going to die any second because my teammates are not supporting me. Oh, never mind. We made it. We made it. I'm dead. I'm dead. Anyone else wants to line up? Damn it. We killed like half the team. Everyone just wanted to line up in front of me. In this video, and I've only been recording for what, 20 minutes? I've already died every single way possible. In this game someone uh tossed well i didn't die to a tomahawk yet but someone almost killed me using their tomahawk i got finishing moved i got meleeed a couple times kill streaks rcxd uh bouncing betty every single way possible that you can die in this game i've died already in 20 minutes man 20 minutes all i wanted to do is simply just jump in Talk about BO6 and how excited I am for it. And just play Black Ops Cold War, man. That's all I wanted to do. That guy's running away. Or not. See? What did I tell you? What did I tell you? Hey, uh, guys. Do you possibly want to play objective and maybe possibly capture B? Any good stuff? Are they spawn? Yeah, they are. Good stuff. There's a guy below us. Good stuff. See, this is how you dominate. All I have to do is just turn my mic on in game and just ask him to please, please, please capture B. All I had to do was be nice. Just remind them because for some reason, maybe they thought we were playing TDM. I'm not too sure. Some of them were not even looking at the minimap for the most part. 
So I guess they just needed a friendly reminder from Mo of G. I thought someone was gonna ask me to shut the f up or something. At least they listened. As soon as they said it, everyone pushed B. I guess I'm a born leader who keeps dying. <laughs> we might still lose this game. I think we're, no, hold on, hold on. I don't think we're losing, right? We still have A. No, we, we got this. Such a close game though, such a close game. All right, this is gonna be a game on Raid, one of my favorite maps ever when it comes to Call of Duty. This is gonna be the last game, no matter what happens, I don't care if I die a million times, if they invent a different way of killing me, because again, that seems to be the theme for this video. But this is gonna be the last game we play today, so hopefully, hopefully it's gonna go well. It's time for me to go off and end this on a good note, because so far, gameplay's been tough. I don't know what to tell you. I think that's the same guy we played like 20, 30 minutes earlier, if I'm not mistaken. He has the same skin and that's his signature move. Just mailing my ass. It's fine. All good. I'm going to calm down. I'm Bro, you can't make this up. <laughs> this is not scripted. I kid you not. This is not scripted. Like what's going on, bro? He's just like popping up every time I try to say something positive. Like I'm trying to be optimistic. There he is. I called it. I called it. I'm trying to be as optimistic as possible, but every time I try to speak, this guy just kills me. Damn. <laughs> I'm literally gonna start sweating in a sack. Oh my God, bro. <laughs> Alex, please, man. Don't do me dirty. This is gonna be my last game. He's to the right. He's over here. There's another guy. See, I told you, I heard him. But for some reason, I can't hear Alex. Yeah, I, I don't think I'm meant to play this game. Especially when Alex is online. Calm down. Calm down. Oh my god, he was waiting for me in the corner. I mean, listen. You can think he's camping, but at the same time, he's not using a weapon. He's not using a gun. And I kind of rate his uh, play style. Come on. Come on. You need to die, bro. Literally, the last bullet I had, I wasted a full magazine, a 50-round magazine, just to kill this guy because he's a movement king. I know I might lose this game because... Because we're losing all the games we're playing today, but... As long as I can kill this guy more than he kills me, I'll take it as a win. That's going to be the mission for this video. Or the mission for... Oh, Alright, I have two more kills to even things out. He's killed me five times. I've killed him three times only. And I believe he's waiting for me in the corner. I mean, it wouldn't be that impressive to kill him more than he kills me. Because I have an advantage. I have an operating gun. Someone to my right. Come on, man. But yeah. Oh, there he is. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Wait, did I not? Bro, let me kill him in peace. I'm gonna use my teammate as bait. If I can. Oh, there's Alex. Alex, come back. No! I got him. Right? That counts as my kill, no? I think it does. I'm going to wait for him. I'm going to play his game. Come on, Alex. Ah, uh, half time. I think he was to the right. Where's Alex? Oh, Alex. Moe's looking for you. No, I didn't want you to... Mantle. What the fuck are you doing? Is that Alex? Where's Alex? Hello? I haven't seen him in a few minutes. Come on, we got a cab B2. I'm losing focus of, on the main objective.
Daddy's looking for you. Oh no, he smoked it. He smoked it? Where's Alex? There he is. Let's go. <laughs> Why is it so satisfying killing this guy? You can tell I've been tortured by him. Two games already. <laughs> Two games, man. Alex! I got your little ass. Or is he spawning? Spawns flip. No, there's no way they flipped. Man, I feel so bad. I think I'm winning at the moment. I think I've killed him one more time than he's killed me. Man. And we're slowly making a comeback. We're controlling B. And hold on, there's a guy down there. Come on. Come on. He's in the water. This for me. There you go. As long as we don't lose B, we'll be fine. And we need to try our best not to flip the spawns. Man, come on, teammate. Why did he have to block my view? Is that I, No, never mind. That's not Alex. All right, come on, come on. I'm very close to getting my war machine. As soon as I get it, I'm going to go crazy. Six to seven. He's slowly making a comeback, and we're losing B. Things are going downhill as we speak. There he is. Man. Game's over, and I know he's going to kill me any second now. I know he- Oh! Shit! He actually got me. I mean, I think it was 7 to 8. I killed him 8 times, he killed me 7, so I did win. Obviously, I wasn't holding a knife, so I needed to hit him twice, and I managed to hit him once before he actually knifed me. Yeah, I think this is enough Black Ops Cold War for me for at least a week, man. <laughs> this is too much. Yeah, I'm done, man. I'm done.